Hey, welcome back to the Marvel and DC Theories and Marvel and DC Explained. And if you're new here, welcome. It's been a while since we did a, a regular sized video instead of the portrait TikTok style. It's been a minute since we did a landscape. So the, we, the reason why you see this format is because I will be editing and putting this into a shorts format. So the camera needs to be a little bit smaller. Anyway, let's talk about the Scar of the Witch movie that technically that just got confirmed by Bo DeMeo. And this also is the scrapped plan for Multiverse of Madness. So without further ado, let's get into this, um, which I will be geeking out. So X-Men 97 showrunner Bo DeMeo is spilling all the tea on Twitter via X in regards to his firm, uh, former employees, well, employers. This time revealing a bunch of details on their original Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness script. So, OG Drafts did her Scarlet Witch justice. Wanda was with Strange recovering after Westview. And if y'all know Westview via the, the events from the WandaVision show, um, which we will be getting more tie-ins into uh, Agatha all along, which comes out in two days of, you know, as I'm recording this video. We're, well, technically one day because it's about to be the 17th. Anyways, um, see, I'm already geeking out. <laughs> Uh, after recovering uh, from the events from Westview, feeling bad ab about what she did, she helps him, Wong, and Chavez, who she tutors, be Nightmare. So, night all those rumors and plot leaks about Nightmare being the villain for this movie were officially true. So, they beat Nightmare across mul uh, the multiverse where she also sees her variants happy with her kids. Oh, excuse me, um, Billy and Tommy that we, you know, got from the WandaVision show, uh, WandaVision show. So still Wanda resists and she, not Chavez, helps Strange save the day against Nightmare, who turns out to be a dark hold corrupted Strange variant, which bro, I'm like, okay, this is this is pretty cool and it makes i'd love it i would love to see would have lo loved to see like it would have made sense to give us a variant version of nightmare which a lot of us kind of predicted i feel like there's a lot of theories out there i know i had it there like what well, would we get a a variant of nightmare or a fusion of nightmare and mephisto there was tons of theories about that as well anyways um who turns out to be a dark hold corrupted strange variant also, she used her experiences in WandaVision to warn to warn Chavez about abusing her power. Only after saving the day, unable to resist finding a multiverse where she can break, uh, well, where she can be with her kids, does Wanda, sobbing, break from Strange and accidentally beheads Wong, who tries to stop her from fleeing into the multiverse. That was the film's cliffhanger. Like, whoa, Wong being beheaded? This is nuts. That would have been absolutely insane. And I'm like, bro, a lot of this would have been cool. For one, let me pull up this image right now since I'm geeking out. Nightmare, dude. Having Nightmare have his appearance in this would have been absolutely gritty and would have made a lot of sense because like i said there was tons of rumors of uh nightmare being in doctor strange 2 aka doctor strange of the multiverse of madness there were so many so many rumors um and it confirmed a lot of stuff and not even that like the cliffhanger would have been pretty cool because it would have kind of i guess lead into the direction a lot of us kind of know where marvel is going which is um, Marvel's Children's uh, Crusade, which is pretty much the, um, I feel like this has a lot of tie-ins and like what we're getting, they can't go obviously tidbit, tidbit piece for piece from this comic issue, but they are technically building up, like come on with Doom, um, the list goes on with characters like Billy and Tommy. We're going to be getting the reincarnated versions. Um, 
well only one of them we're going to be getting in this agatha all along i hope it's a cliffhanger where we can maybe see i can i won't be surprised if it's either a wanda cliffhanger of her actually being confirmed alive or something leading it to the young avengers because i've been realizing that's been the the post credit scene we've been getting teased a lot we got that with i think the miss marvel i don't know if that was miss marvel with kate bishop um what or it was a movie i can't remember but kate bishop yeah the end of captain marvel 2 it was a post credit scene tying it to that so it was just it's just a lot um and like i said just geeking out already but dude this is just crazy a scarlet witch movie confirmed and i feel like there's just so much they could do with the storyline like they could either continue like go way more deep with wanda's uh wanda's character um or they could just pretty much give us a a closure like oh we need this character um to stop doom and all that because doom is a big character and the fact that her and wanda well him and wanda had a relationship in the comics is very very vital and like i said he was a big crucial role and so was she in the children's crusade so i do think we will be getting more ties into that anyways enough for me geeking and ranting y'all let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below I, i'm just i cannot wait for this i cannot wait don't forget to follow subscribe i'm gonna catch you on this video and live stream